anyways. Next, let's do our next track, shall we? Our next course license. We're going to the dirt in the Swiss Alps. Oh boy. Be interesting. Be interesting. Wow, immediately with the alt. All right, interesting. All right, Reaper, you might have to do some sorting in H fill while I uh, tackle the Swiss Alps in our in this Toyota RSC. Fuck. This is a. Uh... All right, this is a challenge. This is a challenge for my tiny, stupid, idiot brain. assistance. I don't know why I keep, like, just overturning there. I'm just hitting the fucking bridge. Like, oh, the road's still turning. It's still turning. Guess what? It's not turning anymore. Anti-capitalism, like anti-consumer. Uh, wrong person, but you know what? I'll accept that reaper. I was more talking about yeet. There we go. We got the gold. That was a bit of a pain, but God, oh fucking shit! Did it? It's fine. Ta-da! That was fucking golden. We got the gold. Yeah. Hell yeah! All right, let's get our prize cars. Small improvement, cut half a second, you know, as I do. So for bronze, we get a lotus, or no, yes, a lotus. Ooh. And then for gold, we're gonna get another touring car. This time, it's a Honda, it's a Honda Accord, maybe? It even has a GT Concept livery. Or logo on it. That's cool. <laughs> Gold stick it up your ass. That's cute. All right, let's check out our cars. So we have the Lotus Elise Type 72 for bronze. Oh, it's an Integra. Okay. Very nice. Only available in black. And then the Integra Type R LM Edition. Very nice. I love these dream touring cars. They're so cool. And with that, we can now race at the Swiss Alps. Yeah, so let's start with Babby mode. And uh, let's go. The LM edition. That's what basically the dream cars are called. Like the fantasy race cars. LM edition. Because we're on the dirt, we have a limited selection of cars here, so we can only choose vehicles that are able to drive on the dirt. Uh, I'm going to drive the Focus RS. Why? Because I can. I'm going to do it. Later than usual. I'm going to go a little bit over time just because I want to make... I was expecting to make more progress than this, so... Oh, he can't do that! And just like in GT3, the dirt races are 1v1s. So... Here we go. Focus versus focus. Joe down. F8 
FF in the dirt, fucking why not? I mean, uh, the, like, lower, uh, lower tiers of rallying use front-wheel drive cars instead of four-wheel drive. Consider this the junior rally class. It's not like rallying FF cars is difficult. It's got to be wary of your throttle input. Actually, I don't. I remember Max like being like, "Why can't I see certain messages?" That's why. It's like, "Oh, that's fucky." Streamlabs OBS sucks. You should use stream elements. What if I told you I used neither of those? If you're trying to, like, advertise stream elements, you're doing it in the worst way possible. What are we doing? We are, we're, we're getting dirty. What do I use then? I just use regular OBS Studio. Yes, whatever the fuck it's called. We. He's nuts. Thank you, Reaper. Yeah, and congratulations on assuming the, uh, you know the answer and being wrong. Aha, I win! You know what? Here's my uh, response to that. Again, worst possible way to advertise stream elements. Congratulations, I'll never use it. Now because of you. I won by four seconds over the other focus. Pretty, uh... Small margin, actually, for this difficulty. But we did it, and I'll lean. Yay. All right. Building up to that. I'm fucking... I'm done fucking around, Reaper. <laughs> Ordinarily, I'd fuck around, but I'm too frustrated. Oh, we unlocked another focus. RS. Interesting. <laughs> All right. Huh. That's cool. What I use for my timer? Uh, live split. That's what it's called. Yes. All right. Normal complete. Let's go to professional. At the Alps. RS news of this game, maybe? Alright, we can use one of the... I can use the, uh, the, uh, Integra. Hmm. No, yeah, fuck it, I'm gonna use the Integra for this. We'll probably end in tears, but fuck it, let's go. I'm choosing the red livery. Uh, I attempted, I attempted speedrunning a long time ago, but then I realized it just wasn't for me. Oh, we're going against an RSC, okay. But I realized quickly it just wasn't for me. I just, I can't play the same game over and over and over and over and over and over and over again. Cannot change the tires, but I won't change the tire. Me. Oh well. Alright, see if I can beat a Toyota RSC with this thing. All-wheel drive versus front-wheel drive. This will be interesting. <laughs> I 
to the fucking tack needle. Also, this thing revs really high. Alright, I'm hoping that because the RC is a big fucking chunk that I'll be able to, like, keep up and maybe even beat him. Um, the game I tried to run was Sonic 3D Blast, because that was, like, the only game I had, because there weren't any, like, major stupid shit that you had to do. Like, it was just a basic optimization run that I'm like, yeah, that looks good for me. But I did it a few times. My PB was somewhere in, like, the low 30-minute range for any percent. And then I'm like, actually, I don't want to do this. <laughs> I, I reminded myself why I have the desire to play several different games and not just stick to the same game all the time. Whee! Alright, he fucking parks it. He's breaking zones, that's good. There's Sonic game, uh, for the reason I just said. Because there's no, like, crazy weird tricks you have to do, it's just optimization. And also because I love the music in 3D Blast. At least in uh, the Genesis version. That's what I'm gonna say. Hey, the game lets me do it, so I'm doing it. If you have a problem with that, take it up with fucking Polyphony. Circa 2002. Maybe, maybe Honda saw, uh, saw this and GT's like, actually, you know what? That'd make a good touring car. And they made a real one. Caro. Not gonna lie, I'm actually surprised I'm winning this race. That fucking sucked. VF2. I don't know what VF2 is. I mean, they had to approve this car. Probably, for licensing. So, you know, oh, Virtua Fighter. I've never played Virtua Fighter. I don't do fighting games. The only fighting games I had in any remotely remote interest in ever playing is Smash Bros. And even then, I stopped caring about Smash Bros. because I don't have friends. <laughs> Wee. Dude, I'm pulling away from the RSC. I'm not just winning, I'm dominating right now. I'm actually pulling a gap. But, like, who all plays Smash? From try the best for the drive, yes, clearly. Anyways, Smash kind of goes into my whole I don't really care for multiplayer stuff, because, like, Basically, playing Smash with against people, or with people, would be one of two things. Either I get my ass kicked, or I get my ass kicked really hard. And basically, either of those situations does not sound fun. I win! You know what happens when you tell me what to do? They put in timeout. I won by seven seconds. That was a larger gap than the uh, RS than the the focus mirror mirror match. Integra best rally car. Integra LM best rally car. Clearly. 
All right. Ooh, what are we getting here for our prize on professional? Oh, yeah, it's this thing. Pontiac. Is this the first time Pontiac's been? No. Maybe? Is this the first time Pontiac's been in GT? I can't remember if Pontiac was in GT2. I don't think it was. Anyways, Pontiac Solstice. Hey, well, this looks a bit, a lot different than the production version. Early Solstice, yeah. Interesting. Well, we've done that. We're at 29% instead of 30% because the game is weird. But we still have one more race to do here at Swiss Alps. And that is the ace difficulty for our true 100%. So, we'll do that. Let's get into racing cars, which is just limited to the rally cars. And let's use... Let's use something new. That's not new. Where's... There it is. I'm like, wait, where's the Evo 7? Here's the Evo 7. I found it. So we have the Evo 7 prototype in GT3. Now we have the Evo 7 proper here in GT Concept. Concept. Con. Con. And we're going against the RSC again. Okay, well. Interesting. It's no longer a prototype. Tommy Mac and Cheese. Oh, yeah. You can tell they just kind of, they, they took the concept and just kind of added a little bit to delivery. By concept, I mean the prototype. They just add like a couple, the, the Tommy to the front and put number seven on one of the num mini number plates. A little wheel spin. It's because all four tires, four wheel drive, baby. Anyway, this should be an easy win. Also, I guess ace difficulty on the dirt tracks is going to be four laps as opposed to five. That works just like arcade mode GT3, where the dirt tracks on uh, hard were four laps instead of five. Consistency. Oh, there's a Tommy on the wing as well. <laughs> the white squares are silly. This way, by the way. RSC doesn't stand a chance. I'm getting left. Hardest difficulty, largest margin of victory incoming. We get to enjoy the wonderful GT3 aesthetic some more. Honestly, I don't know GT. You're getting into uh, specifications I know nothing about. Technology. Wow. Cue the fucking anime girl. Wow. That everyone fucking uses now. Alright, two laps down, two to go. Oh, yeah, I just dropped fucking 2,000 frames. Hell yeah. Alright. Good shit, good shit. Comcast certified quality. Oh, 
Well then. Anyways, welcome back. We've missed uh, nothing exciting. <laughs> technology. What's that about technology? I will show you technology. Dead. He's not in this. Uh, I'm not going to confirm nor deny that. Fuck around and find out. Don't spoil it, chatter. You will lose your chat privileges for a whole week. I'm not fucking around. Potentially be terrible person in someone's chat, haha. Funny. Why we? Smooth. Time to feel the game. Well, that was fucking easy. Probably should have given me a tougher competition than the fucking <laughs> RSC. Nope. <sighs> so, what is this margin of victory going to be? Let's find out. 25 seconds. Boom. Not even fair. Not even fair. You can say he got... East. I'm funny. Alright, anyways. There we go. Ace difficulty win. Imagine saying someone's rude because they didn't take your bait. There we go. There's the first place. There's Dat. We are at 29% completion. And with three tracks complete. Decent start to the LP, I say.